There we go. It took a second to start up, and I actually need to get it to set over to Monstrum. Let's close out of Elgato. It's probably going to take a second for it to go away. Yeah. Because Elgato is so entitled in how it has to take up a little bit of time anyway. And i got to do the usual thing for, like, checking audio of myself for one second on the preview. And then move the game over. Come on. It's okay for you to start up on the video preview. Uh, it is actually going, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm streaming, of course. Why is it not showing the preview? <laughs> I'm signed in, and it's doing things. Reconnecting. Okay, let me reset my dashboard. Hopefully it doesn't mess anything up all awry. <laughs> it's probably the weirdest technical difficulties I've been having at the start of the stream. la -dee da Checking the technical difficulties I've been having Okay, I'm here and stuff, and it's going to be looping if I don't close it. There we go. All seems to be well. La -dee -da -dee -doo -dee -doo. All right, and I believe we should be good to start the game. So let's do this. I don't know why I'm snapping my fingers so much and stretching. <laughs> I think I like a uh, stretch like this the other day, and a kid around me was like, "How do you do that?" I'm like, eh, "I'm just doing it. It's not something that I usually do to make loud, crackly noises." And of course, it's always. Urban legend, people say if you crack your knuckles, it's going to give you arthritis later on, but no, it's just like the air bubble popping, it's actually, I guess, if you, um, of course, it's not really great, it's better for you to let it happen, I mean, like, yeah, you relieve yourself, uh-oh, talking out my booty hole when I don't need to, looking around my room when I don't need to, got my water down here if need be, on top of a napkin, because I'm just sitting on my computer down there, just don't want to have it sitting on my desk, so you can hear bubbly noises, the noise of that fan up there, maybe picking up anyway. I just want to have my gain up high enough for things to be loud enough when I upload to YouTube. Don't need the lighter. I do want the fuse. I'm mean, like, video games, they're a want in general. Let's see, okay. If I had a glow stick, I could put it down there. Put her there. And then he puts the dolly, because that's how the SpongeBob episode be. I'm not hearing the stomping of the brute, because that's just me being a little glitchy. Doom, doom, doom. Alright, let's so keep that one there in case I want to use a bottle for whatever reason. For whichever raisin. Raisins are good. I had a weird rum raisin ice cream earlier. I don't know if that's actually imbued with rum. If so, that would be the most alcohol I've consumed in my life. Forever alone. Ah, that's not even correlated to my status of stuff. I don't know. Got some duct tape. Always an elusive item. Wonderful to run into earlier on. Uh, yeah. I don't need the lights off, but I choose to have it that way anyway. Alright, kind of losing my bearings. Okay, I think it's a big hallway for me to go into. This right here. I don't need to open any of these guys. There's my glow stick. Alright, I need to start cleaning house with my items. A couple things for the raft. I already got the fiend, and I'm not gonna attempt to fake too much. Just gonna go ahead and hide. Toast up my fingers a little bit. I don't know, it's just like, like when you're rubbing your hands together, it's like you're creating the friction by a fire, which you need to do as well with the, if you're actually doing kindling. <laughs> Never actually succeeded in doing anything like that. I've like rubbed pencils together in school and got pretty hot. Could have been potentially dangerous. Potentially. Because that's whatever, something I say sometimes. For whatever reason. Uh, no fiend to worry about. I'm like, yeah, of course I have to worry about it. Uh... I always seem to run into it when I'm on the stairs. Uh, are you below me? Or? It's kind of breaking up the light there. Let's make sure you don't cause trouble on the stairs. It's uh, readjusting my face, making facial adjustments. I think that was just a glitch rather than him actually doing some stuff to the light. Yeah, I'll go ahead and drop this fuse off at the sub. So I hear humming. Now I'm just hearing the humming of my other ox cores, but that's just for ambience more than anything. <laughs> Aside from all the ambience that I'm actually working with in the game. Uh, no dudes here, unless he's up there. No, he's not. <laughs> like, uh, all these times I've been streaming, lots of them actually haven't been doing too well. <laughs> I've only done the ultimate challenge one time on video. I've done it, like, probably over 30 times by this point. Okay, about say if I died there. That would have been added in with a recent update. So, try not to have a big ol' obtrusive item. 
fuses are always great and a flashlight if I were to actually use it, but it takes up a slot. I don't need that slot. Well, I mean, I need that slot. That's why I don't use the thing. <laughs> I haven't even bothered going into a cargo hold region yet in these couple streams I've done. Is this stream number four of my stream? Yeah, because the first one was my best so far. And then the second one was like, I'm not really feeling it. Third one, I'm feeling it, but I'm just not doing too great. Alright, I think it's catching up with the Kardashians down this way. Make sure he's not actually in that room. I think he is. Oh, is he on this floor now? Uh, he's coming from over there, so if he chases me, he chases me. But he's not chasing me, so he has to kiss me, because he can't catch me. Is that how it works? Right. Is that how he does it? Or is that what he calls it? That's, that's what it is. Confused him my Spongebob quotes, man. Wait, is he coming up here? Okay, it's starting to act weird. Backpack space, I'd definitely like to come back for that if I get an egg timer. Uh, is he coming this way? Let's see if that light flashes over that way. Blink my eyes, remember to blink. Normal human things, but sometimes cognitive load pushes you away from that. Make sure he doesn't come from there either, but it seems to be weaker over that way. Uh, it could just be moving along and actually put some distance between us, but I'm pretty sure it rubber bands. Listen for sounds. Sorry, we're good. Come back that way if I get a hold of an egg timer. For sure, I already fully explored that floor, so keep a mental note that I am done with three. But as for now, we move along even when our hope is gone. I am going to drop that off by the thing. Although we could ignite it, I could be Ignacio. Ignacio, you know, the Spanish name, better call Saul, guy called Nacho, played by, uh, what is the guy, Michael Mundo or something like that. <laughs> like, he looks Hispanic, he's like, Hispanic, Hispanic, but Canadian. I don't really know what the hybrid term for that is. Latino. I think that's the big overarching things. Of course, I'm not a racist individual, but I try to actually be considerate of proper terms, but... I don't think it's too much of a big deal. <laughs> Another duct tape, I don't think I really need too much. Because I always do the self-imposed challenge of not duct taping cameras, because they're easy to get out of the way of anyway. <laughs> Even though they kind of screwed me over a lot in these past few times I played. Hello, Fuse. Probably going to reserve you for the engine room. Is he coming over this way? Because I saw the lights breaking up the way they were. By myself some time. No worry for jump scares here. No items on the floor. So, no items, period within these. I mean, like, yeah, there could be, like, a sub-battery or... It always seems to be, like, a either sub-headlight or a sub-battery in that particular spot that I was eyeballing. Speaking of eyeballing, I'm not gonna use the tape, just gonna... <laughs> I was not really out of the range, but I kind of looked out and it didn't really stick on to me. It'll stick to ya, <gasps> like duct tape. That's supposedly, what's that called? Camel case, like the Pokemon games, Heart Gold. It's camel case, because you capitalize the G as part of one word instead of putting it into two words. Even though I put it in two words in my LP titles, haha. <laughs> Alright, pretty much got the side down. Plus a little bit more, I think. This room was the bathroom, right? Yes, sir. Uh, let's see. Be careful of where he's coming from, where he's going, where he's caught in that joe in. I'm pretty sure I made that joke last night or something. But that's me always reusing my jokes and mentioning that I... Reusing my jokes, make sure it's not actually being bad. Also, open this up to have potential escape route. Oop, B, oopa. He's coming around the mountain. Make sure he doesn't come too close. I'll just have a fun little war with him if need be. It's not going fully broken, but I'll hide regardless. Maybe not make too much noise. If he comes towards this room, I'll slam it and he's gonna. Aggro in some way is getting in closer frequency. I'll go ahead and it. <laughs> and I can't actually gauge what's going on, but I can see if the door unlocks because that's what he does with his psychic powers. With his sidekick powers. <laughs> this is it. The moment you've all been waiting for. I don't know why. Ugh, my hands just feel so dry. I even washed them so I can uh, more safely put in my contacts. So I was thinking about wearing my glasses, but. Well, I do want to play Monster Room, so I'll put in my contacts because the camera's right there. I'm looking right at you guys. Ooh, hello. Speaking of potentially being able to look right at me, watch for the solid light to get even more solid. It's breaking apart a little bit. We're distancing ourselves. Sorry, we just can't handle this. Okay. He 
has left the building. Not necessarily Elvis, but he's not too close for comfort. I mean, it's always uncomfortable with Fiend, or any monster for that matter. Uh, I think he's still on this floor, just uh, well, not immediately. Just gotta listen for sounds because I do have my volume down a little bit. Don't believe I explored this sector, so I shall explore this sector. What do we got? <laughs> I keep thinking that's the thing, and that reminds me, if I get a hold of a radio rate timer, I can go back for that backpack way back where. <laughs> it's like a Dr. Seuss rhyming scheme that I've got going on there. Even by finishing that sentence, I will sentence myself to jail. Uh, now we're getting somewhere. Come on. Okay. <laughs> See, I was playing with destiny or something. Ain't nothing, just smug. Don't bother with those. Even though a lot of people don't bother with glow sticks. Uh, I just don't really play around with mugs that much in the actual video. Aside from getting the hunter achievement, just toss one towards the hunter and get the achievement of luring it out. It's called like bait and switch or something like that. Uh, helicopter keys in there. Uh, and a nice little fire extinguisher. Wonderful. Only use fees fuses when needed. I don't need you. I mean, like, yeah, you could be somewhat useful if I wanted to blaze it up with the fiend. Have corporeal experiences. But I'm not looking for that right now. I'm just looking to have a sober good time. Unless I'd be made unsober by that supposedly rum infused ice cream that I had earlier. I mean, it was from Publix, so how strong can it be? <laughs> It's kind of an unintentional roast on Publix. More than anything, Publix is expensive. That's why I said to Walmart, plus my mom works there, so there's the employee discount. At least, that's what she gets. Doo -dee -doo -dee -doo. Why am I scatting something like that? No, not scat, like Savannah College of Art and Science, scatting. And not scatting as in, you know, dookie. And not dookie as in dookie, Chad, the YouTuber. <laughs> I'm not driving my point home, am I? Alright, okay, you... Oh, yeah, that's kind of a problem I had. I seemed to stop my keyboard at one point. I was like, oh, let's give up on the brute. But I was caught up in the moment. I was like, eh, I'll just take the L. And I did say that. I was like, yeah, I'll take the L when I was fighting the brute last night. Hey, a radio. Hey, Vsauce, Michael here. Uh, so you like a gas canister in here or something a little bit more useful, but it's useful enough for me. Is he coming close? Uh... There's no light right there, and nothing really seems to be breaking down, but it does seem a little bit weaker than it usually is. Listen very closely. <laughs> should probably do something to make less noise with all the stuff down here. Like, yeah, it's not too bad. I could unplug something, but I could leave potential for more damaging sounds. Like it's damaging in the first place. Oh well, I'll just deal with it. I could stream Mario World. Oh, I see him coming up my way. Express he didn't catch sight of me. I don't know why I'm not singing Mario World. Let's see, I could toss the radio down there and have him be attracted to it, but he'd be more likely to break it than if I were to use an egg timer and lead him away. Strategizing on the fly because I am a fly individual. Say some gangsters this in your fly girl, you just give him one of these. Uh, I was thinking like shooting stars or the Persona 5 battle theme. Being a little risky by doing that, but at least I'm using up my items. And here's what I was trying to do earlier, but I'll just go ahead and pull this. It's probably gonna start chasing me, yes indeed. Out of line of sight. Uh, boom. Yeah, I was trying to hop down the place. <laughs> Uh, get me to some security so I can collect my senses. Come on, you are solid. Why are you being solid? Uh, I can tell you what else is being solid bodily right now. Let me gather my thoughts. Yeah, I was going to try to do a thing where I jump down to a door, but I had to pull up the life wrap so I can actually see what I was doing, but then I started being chased. So I just have to play the game like a normal human being, cowering and hiding. Come on, you know you want to say you're still on this floor, so don't go solid on me, Mr. Light like that. I light it like that. Never power up right here unless you just want to see useless security cam footage, which is not even 
actual footage because it's just still images. Just for nice visuals of what other rooms can look like, even though I'm pretty sure it's always the same. But all in all, it doesn't show what the monster is doing, so none too useful if you want to save your fuses, especially for an ultimate run where you need at least two fuses for the engine room, which is something I consider part of the ultimate run, because it's like a big old interactable room. And the sub escape, of course. Man, the music was playing for a long time until he actually came in here. But you never know, he could find me. So uh, you have that chair all the way because sometimes it'd be dangerous. If he looks under a thing, I will just like spray him or make a run for it. Is there something up there? I want to see. Is there keys? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe nothing necessarily up there. What do you got? You gonna look under? Make sure. Yep. Now I'm gonna book it. I'm gonna Bible it as well. Haha. <laughs> even though the Bible is a book. Up for debate whether it's fishing or non fishing though, but I'm not gonna do something like that in a stream. Make sure it doesn't go solid. Yeah, I shouldn't uh, play around too much. Why are you playing? The eyes are bothering me because I'm never too used to wearing contacts outside of school, especially right in front of my computer screen, but of course I keep mentioning that. I need to talk about new things like my potential for death in this video game that is trying in my soul. Stuttering, trying my soul in different ways. It's going in different axes. Okay. Seems to have left this floor. It's so not too big a threat. Is he outside? I don't see any non-solid lights. Even those lights did not out there didn't seem as strong as they usually are, but I just be beep 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 be, because I was in the place. <sighs> Fun times with Mr. Fiend. You know what, I'm actually gonna mute my mic when I blow my nose this time, okay? Saving some trouble. I wasn't actually saying anything there. Or was I? No, I wasn't because my face would actually be a little bit more trashed up than it was because that's, I guess that's what it looked like, but I wasn't saying anything. <sighs> Are you going to do something that's not bad? I mean, if I was playing this a little bit less cautiously, I'd be out on the belt regardless, but never be too safe. Alright, when it's like that, assume that it's safe. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, when I started to go out here, Previously, it did things in different ways. Alright, let's see if there actually is something in this room. Always a cupboard there. I mean, not always. Sometimes it's helicopter keys and sometimes they're right here. No. Nothing. What about right here? Sometimes they kind of clip through things. Like great clips, which is something I should probably visit. Or a local haircut lady. One more time before I move. Because yeah. I do kind of have a mullet going on. But I like that hairstyle. Maybe not necessarily in this day and age. Would it be too useful? <laughs> uh, business in the front, party in the back, is that how it goes? Josh McDermott as Eugene Porter from The Walking Dead could better explain that to me with the more experience. Earning the nickname haircut from... Uh, who was it? It was like a rock or something or a different character. Why am I talking about Walking Dead stuff? Fear of the Walking Dead is coming back on June 4th. Kind of excited for that, even though not a lot of people are too big on the show. Come on, what are you doing? Let's see, actually, what you're doing if you pass by briefly. Or, you know, if you come into this room, searching around to no avail because you're not going to lock onto me like you've done previously. I mean, yeah, I wasn't really playing it too smart yesterday. The Fiend is supposedly the smartest monster. I mean, it makes sense because the Brute is big and dumb, but also fast. I mean, it wasn't as fast previously, at least not until, I want to say a little bit before the year update, where the balance through was actually being a decent threat, as fast as it is, and rubber bandy, instead of moderate speed. Come on, can you just leave the premises? Oh, here you are. It's settling enough that I know where you are, but unsettling is that you're right here with your ugly face and stuff. Yeah, your mama ugly, you ugly, your daddy ugly, your sister ugly, and I'm gonna go so low to say your kids are ugly. You might not even have kids, but I bet they would be ugly. Ha! Man. He's 
probably plotting his revenge that's gonna come back to bite me, even though he doesn't make contact with you, he just uses his telekinetic powers to snap your arm and your neck and all that stuff. And I leave in I'm just like having my tongue at the roof of my mouth like this in a weird way. I feel like I was being possessed by a demonic being. <laughs> Maybe I'll just talk like I'm being possessed every time the fiend comes around. Or every time we touch, I get this feeling. Hey, another bathroom. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I just like I'm possessed every time it comes around. Or when the camera sees me like a weirdo. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing. Something, but nothing I need. Alright. Clearing things out. Oop. Alright, just watch for the solid lights, even though they could be too close anyway. Uh, no hunters to worry about. I don't put glow sticks on right here. I have plenty to work with. Alright, what was I doing? Okay, I put you there, and I just need to pump. I don't even know what's going on here. Oh yeah, I have a gas canister I can pick up, so that covers the two I need. And some more items before being chased like a monkey in the middle. Okay, let me see if there actually is something. Yeah, I can do that. I can demonstrate that, but I want to see if there's an item for me to pick up. He's probably coming from right there. Judging by how things are. No keys, no nothing. Should I hide? Should I run? I mean, <laughs> I should quit dawdling for one. Hey, that was <laughs> another Dr. Seuss style, right? <laughs> I was about to say if it was gonna glitch things up, trying to not let me pick it up. Sometimes you lose items in the mix right here. Especially the duct tape, how small it is. Alright, let's do the thing. Be careful about it. Pull back. There we go. <laughs> Didn't get patched out. I would be an unhappy camper if it was. Oh yeah, I can uh, go back with this radio and try to get that backpack space, so that's nice. Just see if I can do it without getting the radio broken. It's kind of weird though, because you have to pick up the radio, turn it back on again to turn it off, and that could reset him in chasing the location. But let's see how that goes without just explaining it. <laughs> so that's kind of the bad thing I did in games like Pikmin, where I jump cut a lot. It's like, I'm explaining how you do it, so I don't actually have to show it. But come on, this real-time strategy should show everything that's going on, especially if you're supposedly so good at the game. There we go. Fully done with three. Marking it as such. Pretty much the only thing that I, don't, I think we've been needing from two is that over there. Haven't used any sprays, no room to explore because before the stuff, okay, there's this right here, so. Hey, there's a radio that I could have immediately used right there. Ha ha ha. Alright, that was the last little surge of the music there. Alright, so. Do some stuff with my eyes, there we go. Uh, I'm gonna check Discord briefly, because why not? Waba Fett. I was making them jokes. No new things. Back to the dashboard. That is on Twitch. I <laughs> keep wanting to click on Discord to bring me back to Monster, but that's not how you do things, my friend. Shouldn't be spending so much time on the pause screen. And I should be productive with that. So we'll see if I can go past an hour on this, and maybe close to two hours on Pikmin. <laughs> Of course, I say that, and it's probably not going to happen, because that's how things work, especially in the Alpine world. You say you're going to do something, but it doesn't happen, because of the LPR's curse. Something you're bad at, you do great at. Something that's mindless, you fail so much at. Alright, here's the question, though. Which side is he going to be coming from? Well, he could be actually be coming from there, but... Uh, let's see if he actually aggroes to the music. Of course, he's moving a lot faster if he's aggroing to the music. Uh, here's what I'll do. I'll go right here. Doesn't seem to be coming from anywhere there. He should probably be around anyway. But there's no flashing, so... Uh, how about I do a peak pack? A little bit more. There we go, super pack. I don't know why I was thinking about that for whatever reason. Always creepy to see a monster from way down the hallway. <laughs> it's acting like I am seeing it. Don't speak too soon about anything, though. Come on, monster dude, you know you wanna be my friend. Careful of my blind spots. Is he coming? No, it's just the sound of the ship I'm hearing. At least I think so. Is he getting louder? That's usually indicative of him breaking down the room, but it's obviously not flashing at all. Unless he's made it to that point. Oh, hello. Hello. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Send me a kiss by wire. Honey, my heart's on fire. Are those even the words? Let's see. Uh, it's still there, so. Hey, buddy. 
How you doing? Don't chase me. Don't break into the thing. Alright. Holy crap. <laughs> that did me a big frighten. I, I knew he was gonna do something about the tasty human morsel passing by. Let's not double, spend too much time to already check around over here. Over here, everywhere. Yep, ain't too much around. Uh, Alright. Just work my way downtown. Walking and running with high speeds. Drop that there. Make sure it's not actually on this floor. Uh, yeah, pick you back up. Don't actually reset you until it's time to go. Uh, let's just see if he even comes around the mountain in this neighborhood. See what you're doing, Mr. Fiend Man. Even though you could be going super speed. <laughs> That'd be a nice uh, modding thing. You could uh, add super duper speed, like maybe double the speed of monsters or increase their intelligence, make a hard mode, or make it so they can encounter all three monsters at once, or two, or you know, a conglomerate of monsters and mod your own monsters into the game. But you may as well make a sequel if you do that, ha ha ha. Eh, would like to see more actually added to the game instead of just bug fixes, even though, yeah, the game, the game's full release is two years old aside from the beta, which was a year within itself, and then the alpha, which had pretty much nothing. It just had the brute and a really weird depiction of the ship. Pretty interesting, kind of more realistic to a ship as well in certain ways, but I mean, yeah, it's more of a cruise ship as it is now. Alright, so, <laughs> so I get out of Dodge because maybe may be reattracting him. Yeah, I need to mess around with these eyelashes right here. It's like I'm a girl or something that has to do her eyes, get her eyes did. And why is my eye being weird? It's like I'm tickling myself. Like a nice little tickle in my belly. It's probably gonna be around in the corner. Should actually keep fully running instead of being dumb. Oh yeah, I already got my backpack space in. Uh, I think I've like fully explored this area of the ship. I can just, uh, I could go through the cargo room, but I'll just uh, do what I haven't done on the crew areas, even though that's technically crew. I'll call that workspace and call that living space. How about that? Dropped my couple of gas canisters. Still need quite a lot of items. Unintentional voice crack. I'm like, yeah, I was trying to do a little bit higher pace, but not quite making mouse. Okay, he broke that down in a fit of a rage. A fit of anger. Throwing a fit. <laughs> like, uh, I remember in the days I went to the Lemmy Koopa site, Lemmy's Land. <laughs> it says like, this site is now 13 years old, is your internet even that old? Well, duh. But yeah, it's kind of a thing I did when I was in my younger years and I was reading all the fanfiction stories. Yeah, who would have thought? Fanfiction. There was like one about Wendy Koopa throwing a tantrum. I was like, tantrum? Is that like a fancy word for a chair or something? Because Bowser is so fancy. But nope, it's just her being a little girl in her little trope thing that she has. It's like, always Wendy Koopa, that's the bratty girl, because she's the only female born into them. Then Morton Koopa, of course, is the one that's always talking. <laughs> I think his big thing was wedding cake. Yeah. <sighs> that was happening. I think it's, uh, I think it's Larry that liked to grow plants, or he with that, or Ludwig. Why am I talking about weird fanfiction things? Yeah, the mess hall is right here. What? I ran out of glow suits? That's crazy. Uh, okay, I didn't fully explore everything here. So let me get you that. Another glow stick for me to put down. Pause briefly so I can scratch my eyes, but not be rubby too much, because I don't want to mess up my contacts and fuse them with my eyes. <laughs> like my brother, pretty much. I don't think he's taken out a pair of contacts in... As long as he's been wearing contacts. <laughs> so, at least that's one thing I'm good at, actually. Being good with my contacts. I am a lazy individual. I thought I saw the sub headlight, but it wouldn't be in there. I think there are situations where it can't be, though. Situations. Gotta put a ch sound on it for whatever reason. Yeah, one of you. Can I play one? Okay. I think that's like a panicked voice. Eh, I probably should have blew my nose while I was playing, but I was just like doing my weird dance. But let me meet my mic and see if there's monstrous stuff going on.
disadvantage to streaming. You just have to do your little bodily functions as it goes on. I'd be like, yeah, I can switch scenes to be like, BRB, but it would be like a two second BRB rather than like a five minute bathroom break, even though it did take quite a while in the bathroom. I make sure I get cleansed in a proper way. I thought that was like a fuse or something, but nope, just a cup. So I have to use the other fuse. <laughs> use the other fuse, I'm rhyming, huh? When I get to the engine room, and I may have to use one on these locked rooms I've been seeing, such as one with keys, might have been the only locked room I've seen. If my memory serves me correctly, I don't have to worry about it turning on because there's no power in this area. Not gonna worry about turning on the power because I need a fuse for that. Do 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 Sephiroth. Seems how that was the rhythm that was gonna be the do. Me talking all Bill Cosby like and stuff. Where am I going? Okay. It's right here that there is the other side. And then <laughs> quite the long way through. You've come a long way. Like uh, the Robo Birdo says, the Mario Advance, and there's also Step Right Up if you're ready to get toasted. If you would be so gracious as to click a follow button, anyone that may happen to be watching. Uh, do, 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 do. I am not wanting to pick that up or the note because I have all the notes anyway, but I'm doing it anyway. I think I've read them all on screen, but not listened to all the audio notes. I've definitely read the first 10 at least. Uh, okay, you're not coming from anywhere anytime soon. Then I'm going to make a mad dash past you. Wait a second, that I actually fully explore everything that I was trying to explore. Go past you. Ah, oh, yes indeed. There's still this room right here. And it's quite the dead end. I already have two of these. I don't need another one. Open you in case of the need to hide. Just get out of the way in case you try to cause problems. But all the time I'm dawdling could be my demise. Haha. <laughs> you know the pun about demise and... Zelda games, unless you don't, which no power to you because you need to play Skyward Sword. May not be people's favorite because of the motion controls, but beyond that, it is a good game. Okay, yeah. Just uh, being cautious. Boom. I would usually hear the sound of you being crazy anyway. Uh, egg timer over there. You know what? I'm just gonna. How about that? See if I can. Ah, uh, ah, uh, where are you? Right here. Skill pass like that. Lock you up. Lock him up. Things should be better than they're being. At least they're not being found. And as far as it may seem, this is actually a pretty feasible hiding spot. It doesn't really try to find you that much. Alright, let's open up the door. <laughs> It'd be funny if you started the barfing sound like happened in the normal LP as it was going on. It's like an offhand LP. It's like around the time when I stopped counting them, even though I kind of stopped counting them when I was doing the Europe paper. Just Monstrum is a side thing I decided to do, but it's been a pretty sizable LP. Longer than, uh, well, I mean, I did the Kirby trilogy, like the first three Dreamland games, so. The first game was only two videos, but then the second one was seven, then the third was 11. Balancing it out at 20 videos with that full on LP of those games. I don't know. <laughs> Just waiting for things to simmer down, cool your jets and your airplanes and all that. Hey bro, watch your jet. I figured he'd be close enough, but not to where he'd see me. It was a weird angle that I saw me from because he was on the stairs and I was not quite at the angle of the stairs. Must have just been at the perfect spot for him to see me though. Oh well, maybe if I was pressed up a little bit more, he may not even see me at all. Come on, are you even searching for me? The lights aren't even doing things. Come on. Come on, in Amnesia, the music would be stopping when it was out of line of sight, at least. And they're at least somewhat easy to work with, because a lot of enemies don't one-shot you, but the Grunt does. The Brute in both this game and Normal Amnesia usually does one-shot you, or at least two-shot. But in this game, monster touches you, comes into contact, you dead. I'm like, yeah, you have plenty of means of escape and dealing with them. It's all pretty balanced though. Might as well mess around with Pokemon Go. I want to say the monster be glitching a little bit. At least, uh, doesn't really seem to be around to do things. Where is this guy? Right. Uh, I'll trigger you again. 
even though it might be taking you away from the radio. So it may have been a bad call on my part. Let's see how things go. See, I was able to pick up the radio again. Wait, no, I never dropped on him. Do do. I even on this floor, watching the lights. <laughs> I'm gonna be spending the rest of the stream here. Oh boy. <laughs> Hardly even halfway through all the parts. I only really have progress on the raft. I mean, like, yeah, I have the two gas cans I need for the helicopter and the fuse in, which, of course, you're given a fuse from the start. Okay. Things are simmering down into away from the chase music. Uh, but I think I aggroed it away. Doom. Man, I just love the clutch control song, though. Because it's come to be in the official soundtrack. Did I actually really buy the official soundtrack? I think it's still there for me to buy, which... I would like to th toss some money for the developers and the support for... They probably put a lot of money from this game into... What's the other game? Attack of the Earthlings. Kind of like Destroy All Humans. I keep wanting to say that, but it's other ways. I'm pretty sure you actually do play as a monster and try to defeat the humans. It's the prospect of that game, but... Not quite in the vein of monster itself. Come on, I knew you were doing things. Get out of here. Right, let's just see if I can bring you back. Try one more time. Music's actually playing right. Yeah, just uh, get out of a weird earshot range. Or at least it's in weird earshot range. Look at all this progress I'm making. But I'm just using my methods, you know. Okay, there. Now he's around. And you know what? I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna let him break the radio unless I can do something skillful, bring him over my way. But it kind of wraps around. Kind of at a weird spot. So, RIP to the radio right now. Okay, not quite there, but just listen for the big ol' crunch. There it is. At least I timed up big ol' crunch with it happening on the spot. I'm trying to be cool in some way. Anyway, yeah, anybody watching, let me know if there's inconsistencies with quality in both video and voice, webcam. I could, like, I don't think I'm fully synced up, but yeah. And also, if you're watching on YouTube, you can speed it up to watch it faster because you don't want to watch 37 plus minutes in actually 37 minutes. Speed it up by, like, 1.6. Get that HTML5 video speed controller. <laughs> Alright, enough PSAs. Uh, let's see, I don't think you're on the floor, but display is safe. I will tread lightly. Uh, make sure you're not doing things too weirdly. Alright. RP to that radio. I already got a chain spool, so. Uh, there goes that idea, but at least I got a better, so to speak, thing to work with. So to speak thing? I don't know. Speak easy. Okay, you could be a threat. Okay, let's go ahead and hide. I want to play the piano though. I have my piano next to me. So, gee, yeah, that is so deaf. That's why it's got that little bit of a buzzing sound. If I were to unplug it, probably would get rid of the buzzing. You know what? Let me try that. Let's see. I'm like, yeah, let's get rid of it. But if it touches the floor and messes with the static electricity of my carpet, it may make things worse. Especially if it runs against something and makes a worse buzzing than usual. Uh, you know, the logistics of doing electronic stuff. Come on, leave the area. We're here rather briefly, but I'm like, yeah, you must just be patrolling than actually being attracted, because you are an attractive monster. Are you above or below? There's a killer! A monster! Axel in Alien Isolation. Cool dude, cool dude. Uh, I did actually put the chain spool in. Yes, indeed. Ah, uh, let's see. I still need the pump. Okay, here's how I'll do things. I will try to call the fiend up here. Actually, it's four up here. Let me see. Let me smash. I know I didn't explore. So let me go ahead and do my exploration. Then I'm going to drop the egg term into maybe another breakable room. Okay, that was open before. Another fuse. So maybe I could use it for the keys if needed as a last resort. But are they right here? I don't see them. Let's watch my blind spots. Make sure. Going blind with my contacts. Saying all the same stuff. Oop, <laughs> thought that was Pustules of the Hunter. It's like, you know, there can't be two monsters. <laughs> I think they do add those pictures to kind of throw you off. Sometimes you see like a picture of some kind of weird spaghetti concoction. Kind of looks like the Hunter's hands. With how it's blue and jello and gelatinous. Got that nice sub battery. That's actually fully checking the trash. Yeah. Ain't nothing. 
And I believe we are pretty much done with this floor. Just make sure not to be problematic. Uh, let's see what's something I can do. Drop my glow sticks on the other side, which could very well screw me over. Especially being slow over that. Okay, nothing, so do that. Just to feel better about myself. Watch for the lights. And I'll put a night timer, how about right here? Easy to find, huh? <laughs> Good thing it didn't glitch through anything. Now let's get on the move. Ain't no fiend around here. So how about we do the radio? Boom boom boom. Did I actually drop something down that way and forget about it? Uh, yeah, the egg timer's going to be going off soon, so when I hear the first ring, I will do my big old drop down. Okay, there's still something for me to land on. Sequence breaking, but I like doing sequence breaking. I was trying to do it in Pikmin, but of course I'm not trying to do a 9 day run. <laughs> Definitely not doing too great, usually I would reset. Alright, yeah, I said after the first ring, I was going to do the doodly. Pretty sure it's like in that region anyway. So make sure it doesn't actually appear on top of me. Hey, I'm not meaning to drop these things. So of course, me holding the right click kind of locks me into doing that. Okay, <laughs> thought there was like a slowdown going on. He could still see me from this vantage point, but he has a lot to chase after. Uh, I think a cell light's flashing up there. It may just be the draw distance type of deal. Yep, he did break that down. So may see that as a lost cause, even though even if there's only one hiding place that is closed. They may still be stupid enough. And remember, he's ugly. His children are ugly. I don't know why I'm thinking of the a mixture of pants on the ground and rapist in Lincoln Park climbing in your windows. Come on, those are old memes. Oop, he's not around here. I think I attracted him to that side of the ship anyway, which you may think it's pretty far off, but he could definitely make use of the cargo area, which I still need to explore. Once I put the thing into place, then I'll probably work my way to the engine room. I'm not going to go above ground to get my way there, so... I think that's my plan of action. Put the battery into place, like so. If I can actually go up against it like that, uh-huh. And start working my way through. I need the pump for the... well, both the uh, helicopter, technically, and also, you know, just the basic pump for the raft. For the sub, I need headlights and welding kit, so that's something to work for, but I can probably find them around here. And you know, in the Diddly Do engine room, Diddly Do engine room, that's all have it as a pet name, which I may be going into fiend territory. I thought I saw the lights flashing. I keep hearing these little bumpy sounds like, is that the sound of him rustling my jimmies? <laughs> is that the bump I see over that way? Could just be scrap around. Uh, and yeah, maybe just like cams. Or is it a bump? Nah, it's just. Oh, well, here's a bump right there. <laughs> this wasn't looking in the right place. At least I saw it my first time through. Any bolt cutters? It's usually on these straightaway shots. Uh, another thing. Just close up my stuff. Oh, don't make too much noise with that. Make sure I have, actually have a way to go. Uh, I'm making some noise. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with the thing unless. Uh, it's always so weird, like if you jump down, it could lock into getting you. And I'm so apprehensive, I'm not gonna trust it, this place unless I see for sure where he's coming from. Which I can see him on a straight hallway from here. Let's just see. Don't see anything. I mean, like, yeah, I'm already at the point where I can just go up and get to the engine room, so I think I'll do that. As long as he's not there. Uh, not there. Oh, but he's there though. Where's he coming from? Of course, I'm not gonna meet him. Okay, where was I trying to go? I was trying to go this way. He was in the other place, which. Uh, kinda risky doing this, but there's no full on entry. Could just be going through the stairs anyway. He's right up against me, but. Eh. I think I'm playing it a little bit safe. Yeah, gotta watch for the bolt cutters too, because. Could be passing them by. With all these passers by. And by the way, anybody that could be watching, let me know if I'm missing anything. I consider myself pretty good at this game, getting those sub headlights that a lot of people may miss, you know. Okay, I'm actually in the middle area, I believe, so... Or am I by the engine room? Let's see. This will be my tell. Uh, we are in engine room territory, are we? Yeah, deck three. See, I know what I'm doing. Another gas canister that I don't need. 
Get you out of the way in case you try to cause problems. Boom. <laughs> I'm picking these up more just to move them out of the way. Ooh. Yeah, it's gonna light off because why not? Pretty much done with this room if that was the big item that you see here. And plus there is more duct tape for me to get if I oh so desire suddenly just change my mind about using it on the cameras. But I don't necessarily feel the need for that. Maybe another room to explore. Go to the steam, just leaving it there just in case uh, it was so fiend down so I can gauge how he's doing. Hey, I have plenty of fuses to go around so I can get the keys for the helicopter. Just need the bolt cutters, which I could find them in the engine room. Need to do a little bit better about exploring the cargo hold. That's time to Gonna focus on the engine room right now. So at least I can uh, gauge how the monster is doing. The fiend. As fiendish and outlandish as he is. Or, you know, I could go put the thing into place so I can actually free up slots so he is. And you know what? I'll just go ahead and do something here in the engine room. See, I know how things are going with the steam and the steam program that is the wonderful Al for games. It's June 1st, so it's probably going to be opening the floodgates for the Steam Summer Sale soon, unless it's already going on. I don't believe so. I'd be getting... I've been seeing a lot of memes about it. I would be. It sounds like it. I'm saying I have been seeing memes. No, I haven't been seeing memes, even though Steam memes are always so uh, great. Where's he coming from? Just, uh, should I, what should I do? I know he's right here on this sub-level, at least. Uh, or is it more broken apart? Maybe more so right there. Let's watch both ways. Make sure he doesn't actually sneak up on me. Sneaky deaky. Okay, he's coming from there. Alright, so let's just make sure he doesn't actually see me from afar. Still. Holy crap. Alright, he's trying to chase after me, so let's uh, go get down the junction forward, do my thing that I do. That thing I do, yo. Go injection four, lock it up. Lock her up, man. Or him up. Or it up, because you don't know the gender of a ghostly corporeal being. Okay, yeah, this actually is it's locked. Did I not power what? I didn't I put the fuse in but I didn't power it up. What the heck? I am a not smart individual. Should have known that with how things were being. Uh crikey. <laughs> See how Australian I can go when I'm not pleased with my displeasure. Uh, displeasure. Uh, why am I being so risky? Which he doesn't even know where I am. Oh, he may very well know. Maybe it's just not enough to actually see what I'm doing, but enough to be right outside my door coming in. On the outside looking in. <laughs> well, I just gotta make sure my mic's not suddenly muted or unplugged. A few times it's been doing like a thing where it goes like a very faint red where it's not fully plugged in. No, I'm not even going to mute my mic this time. Honk! Aw, oh, yes. Non-substantial nose blowings. At least I'm uh, being productive. Hey, gaming animator. Uh, is that somebody on the Let's Play corner chat? I'm like, yeah, there's probably someone kind of big screen monster. So hello, gaming animator. Sorry if things are being a little bit loud right now. Uh, let's see. Uh, is he in the room? wouldn't really be playing the chase music. Yeah, I didn't even bother that he... Yeah, I didn't even bother unlocking the door. He was outside. He's on this level. He's in that room, pretty sure. Seeing the colorization. Pretty sure he can't see me from here. As slow as he's being. And he's being really slow for whatever reason. Maybe he's just glitching that chase music because if he was actually trying to chase, he'd be moving faster than that. Uh, let's see. I'll just pick it up. Why not? That's the low-key search music. Kind of more creepy if you ask me. Okay, now it's just the stalking music because the big ol' full-on music was going crazy. And dying down. Come on, leave this floor so I can make some progress even though it's probably going up that way, so yeah. <laughs> I can't believe maybe I just like pulled the lever twice or it didn't activate. I did use the fuse because I did have three. Alright, let's see. <laughs> Why am I rhyming unintentionally? Okay, so over that way seems to be more powerful. Coming down the stairs. I do believe. I indubitably believe. <laughs> if he tries to chase me, then he tries to chase me. Oh yeah, so I have to work up to back this way anyway. So 
At least I don't have to worry about him seeing me from down low. On the down low. Yeah, I, I closed it up, but I didn't hit the thing, so yeah. Should've known. I was like, why are the lights being weird? I should at least see the lights on so I can turn them off. In the weird way that things are happening. Uh, I don't usually do it like this, but I'll go ahead and call two from here. Just let it ring a couple times to get him focused on hunting down that way. Ring, ring, bring, bring. And then I close on that. Just uh, carefully work my way down. Seems like he's down there. So maybe try for up here. Okay, maybe just the lights flashing from elsewhere. Yeah, let's mess with the controls. I have the nuclear codes. I am le president. I don't even know if my character is American. It could be one of the Chekhov Wilson guys, or just some unnamed protagonist that is silent. Only conveys his message through writing. Actually takes the time to write. So just like, what the fuck was that? When he's running away from the monster, you know, hiding. Me being the player, and me being the let's player that is talking. Yeah, sorry that I'm... <laughs> Mess with my ear. Now, where are you coming from? <laughs> Sorry that I'm not really doing too much about stuff. Uh, I think I saw his glow down that way, so. Yeah, let's go super cool mode or something. If you don't just sneak up on me from there. At least that big old pinch of parts in the way. I see down below me, because those lights always act weird. I'm like, yeah, that one would be breaking up. So. He's probably making his way downtown. Why do I keep reusing that joke? Don't know, because I am not funny. Wait a second, he's over there and he sees me! Ha 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 ha! You know what? I'm gonna go in here and lock it up. Unlocked. I'm gonna change that to locked and lights out. Uh, no bolt cutters, just normal little trimmer things. Do do do. Do do do. Make sure he's not too close. Go ahead and call two from here. At least, uh, you don't have much blind spots from here. You can easily see if it's coming. Let's see if the light does anything crazy. But nope, it's not on my immediate floor. Because he's being targeted to that. Just don't want him to break it because I do want to call one when I get down to two to work on things. Hey, look at that. Another egg timer. It's cool that I have the bag that I got earlier, so otherwise I wouldn't be able to pick up items. So what if I see a small little thing and then forget about it and not be able to pick it up? Well, maybe I would drop something like this radio so I would remember to pick it up. I don't know. Just doing hypothetical situations. Let's see, is it coming up this way now? I don't know if you broke into Junction 2 because you can't really hear it from here. That's why I go down to 4 so you can actually hear it happening. Then call up to 1, then work your way down to 2, keep him at 1 while you're clearing out 2, and then work your way up. And when you're back at 1, you call him down to 2 so you have the most escape room. See, even more rhyming. <laughs> uh, should I call him up to one? I think I will, but until I actually see him up there, I'm not gonna risk going out into the fray. You found me, you found me, playing Monster Mon Twitch. I'm getting close to an hour. Oh, I see you there, but it's not seeing me. He's being hesitant about his activities. I'm sure he's actually going upstairs, but uh, it's like I'm actually leaning my head so I can see under and over. Let you go into that room so you shouldn't be able to see through the window, through the wall. Let's see, do I pick this up while I can't, even though he's gonna probably cut me off soon. But he didn't have to do that though. Purposefully singing things in a bad manner. But I don't have bad manners, and I may be screwed if he comes into here. But I just want to deal with it in the way that I deal with all these things. Why am I running into so many lighters? Uh, usually see chain spools and stuff right there, but I have all the things you would normally see. So it's probably going to be bolt cutters in the, not bathroom, but the cargo area. May as well be the bathroom because it's definitely a place of pant crappery. Uh, here's the thing though, did he actually break into two, into two with his doo-doo dutifully done? You know, I'm gonna keep you at one. Keep you at bay. Ha ha ha. One ring. Bing bing. Boom boom. Ring ring. And one more. Always gotta follow the rule of three. And no matter what you do, especially in Nintendo games where a lot of bosses take three hits to go down. I mean, 
in Zelda games, there's probably like three cycles of hits if you're actually being productive with your attacking. But in Ocarina of Time, if you're skillful enough with your rhythm, you can take down Ganondorf in one cycle, being kind of loud with everyone. I always like to go with that first because if you hide while the stuff is going on, you just can't hear much of anything. Okay, let's see, what do we got? Uh, maybe coming my way a little bit, so I'll give you a little bit of time, but then aggro you back to number one, because we are number one. Just don't call the one you're in, because that would do the ring ring ring, and of course it would attract him to you. That should be good enough right there, should let that ring actually finish, but I think things are well enough. Don't see things being horrible. Make sure there's no items, maybe bolt cutters, you never know. Uh, all seems to be well. But, you know, I do want me some bolt cutters. You can get a couple things here, probably predicting <laughs> another gas canister. Is there sub welding kit? Not seeing one. Let's just see if it doesn't glitch or anything. Not too hopeful of that. Hopeful that things aren't bad. Uh, yep, you're just right there. So, have hopes for the other room. Could be just be in a basket around here in the engine room. So let's go ahead and leave this room, make sure it's not going too close. Cut and close as well because you're in tight corners, don't want things to be horrible. I think there's a little bit of flashing, but try calling back to one. He still hasn't broken it down, so that's good, but he might be sitting right there and may break it while I'm letting the rule of three take place. Bing, bing. You know what? I'll do a fourth one. So it's number four, right? Alright, there we go. See, playing with nice strategy, but now that I'm saying that my strategy is nice, I'm going to die, but now that I said that, it's going to chase me away, and it's a never-ending cycle of good, bad, good, bad, but it's all predetermined. It's determinism rather than free will. A common psychology debate, at least for the ace realm. <laughs> Definitely don't really need all these closers, even if I use them all in the, whatchamacallit. Oh yeah, so I need to explore uh, floor four on this side immediately above the engine room. So there's still a little bit of hope for that. I think I explored every room. Just need to see if there's any stray baskets that may have something. <laughs> I saw something crawling. It's like, oh, there's not a cucaracha or a palmetto book in my room. Which those are slightly different things. And I've seen them both and freaked out by both. <laughs> I'm just not a big fan of creepy crawlies. So my fear may be being heightened by Princess Toadstool. No, let's just see Ignorance's Bliss song. But the fact that I'm playing Monstro. You know, the captain likes everything tidy, and that's what all these things are saying. Let's let those couple rings happen, and work my way on through, because I am not through with you. He said I was going to say something that was not PC or something. <laughs> Sorry for the sniffles. I'm apologizing to myself that I do such things. Well, because it's kind of cool with the air conditioner going. I don't think it's even going because I don't want to hear it. Hello, you are reaching the voice message of Treklide Tamer. Trying to get the heck out of here. Uh, did I even explore the baskets well enough? I'm not really seeing any because I'm kind of going full circle with everything. Uh, let's go ahead and call you back to two. Just hope for the best with things I haven't gotten yet. I do have the sub headlights. I just need a welding kit. Uh, the keys I can use with the fuse and bolt cutters is another thing to look for in the cargo hole, which kind of banking on that. Maybe on a path that I've already been through and just didn't look well enough, but with the fact that I found the sub headlights there, maybe well enough in that manner. <laughs> if I'm making sense, of course, which I'm probably not. Uh, nothing. Just trying to eliminate any possibilities. There could be duplicates, because that's always possible, but I already got a duplicate with my duct tape. And a lot of gasoline canisters, those two. <laughs> you know what? I could even let you break number two. Just uh, do the calling. Do, 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 do. Sorry, I, I am a lot, I'm admittedly low key farting. Just uh, try not to do it in that it's too loud or disruptive of my bodily stature. <laughs> Maybe TMI, but uh, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> it's my stream, my rules, but I do want to be careful and mindful of things that Twitch does and doesn't allow. I mean, I farted, <laughs> that's the elementary school type of joke, but 
no. I'm just saying things that come to mind. You can call me Donald Trump when I'm speaking what's on my mind. Anyway, enough about the politics. I thought that was another few. It's like, come on, man. Not really anything I'd be needing right here unless I see the helicopter keys. Which I doubt. Because I already have a place to get them anyway. We'll see a bunch of egg timers here. Sorry about my nose. Let me do this again. Not gonna meet my mic again. La -dee da. Ah, it's really drippy. Again, not too much substance with what's coming out of my nose. This must be the combination of my contacts and sitting in front of the computer screen, but I've already explained that crap all the times so I've blown my nose as well. And of course, inflaming my nose vessels that carry blood and stuff. Gotta be careful of things. Alright. Uh, yep, I do have the steam valve off, so I don't have to worry about steam, but it's not going to stop any monsters along the way. <gasps> Lottie Kit, yeah, I had the hunch that it would be the way that it is, but it do. <gasps> I'm going to drop three of these guys here, pick up you. Now all I need are bolt cutters, but I do need to actually put things into place. Make a lot of noise with that. But, let's see if I can get some bolt cutters. Some bolt cutters, you know. Uh, I saw your light flickering, which it could very well be. No, it's just me. Flipping through my items as such. Let's see what I want to do. I want to. I'll go ahead and go up to the raft to get rid of this thing. Then uh, swing back through to the sub, and then see if I can get the bolt cutters anywhere. I have. Go I might as well grab the keys here. But wait, I can't. Wait, well I can just uh, drop the bolt or the glow sticks. <laughs> so confused with all these words I'm using. You know, I don't really need a radio. I'll just go ahead and drop it here. I could probably be better and drop it uh, in a different place. Where exactly was it? Did I use? I'll go ahead and replace it because yeah, I think I used one spray of like four or five that it permits to you. Permits fa? Did I go this way? Yeah, it's just another way through the mess hall. Okay, make sure there's no weirdo flashing. Weirdo trying to flash me. <laughs> weirdo Guido. Uh, it is actually over here where I can get the keys right. <laughs> Not try to confuse myself. Uh, no, because where where was it? It was on before like this. I think it was uh, deck five. And the sound of the rustling makes me think that the fiend's around, but there's no flashing. I'm kind of up against the place anyway, being right here. Don't want to be in this dead end. But I mean, if it sees me, I have plenty of places to duck into. Do 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 do. Right here. Keep things safe enough. Safe haven. Uh, I keep thinking I'm hearing sounds, but I don't want to be too careful or too uncareful with anything. Oh, he was coming from the other side. Ha ha ha. Because he's got to take it on the other side. Red hot chili peppers. Uh, close that up for the extra safety permitted. <laughs> I think I've been chased a couple times through here. All the chases I've been having. Well, I mean, yeah, there's been the other ones. Well, we've surpassed an hour. And we're still on the same run, not even pumping it. Just uh, doing a nice little fist pump. Well, uh, you know, I'll just go ahead and toss you down there. Hide right here because. Wait, it's not even. Eh. I just want to keep tabs on you just to make sure you don't actually chase me. Alright, we're safe from right here. Even though it seems like I'm in broad daylight or nightlight. Come on, why does it go daytime here? Is it forever nighttime? Am I placed in a simulation? of monstrosities psychological experiment oh he's searching from over there <laughs> he knows there's something fishy going on it's kind of creepy yes i said that that was the creepiest form of the music when he was just searching without actually chasing you around uh yeah go up to the egg timer you hear it a chime in so obviously i'm down there and totally didn't toss it down okay he's, he's uh Wrapping his way through, let's make sure that the lights actually do go away. And there's the other right timer up on deck 8. Pretty sure I didn't recoup it. Uh, pretty sure you're going down the stairs right there. Kind of sticking around. But you're kind of gravitating there too. Uh, come on. Make up your mind. I'm like, yeah, you're stronger over there, supposedly. Okay, you're out of this floor. And out of this world, out of my league. <laughs> oh, I thought the chase music was starting, like, starting up. I was like, what? Uh, let me say that in English. I thought the chase music was starting up and I was going to be like, whoa, that is crazy. 
or something of that sort. People always get confused with this. It's all the way left, and then all the way down. You don't have to line up with the thing. You just gotta bring it like that, and put it into place. It even still may glitch up a little bit, but just mess around with it until it actually happens. Mess around with this little security control, or maybe it's Russian security. Ooh, you're... Yeah, I'm like, yeah, I'm making all this noise, of course. Uh, go ahead and try to hide here again. Right, so we're also on the same spot, but... I still have close enough proximity, so I need to lower the raft to get it completed. I can complete the sub with these couple things I have right here. Yeah, because I already did put the battery in that I got way sooner from wherever I did get it. I'm trying to remember, but stressing myself too much on that rather than the monster at hand or, you know, weird appendages that it has. I'm like, yeah, it does have claws. It does have claws. It's cool. It's like, you wave your hand in front of you and do your telepathic powers. Come on, just use your mind. Give your arms a break. But I mean, get up your physical strength a little bit, even if you don't need it. <laughs> the same weird things that go in the mind. Wait for you to go down to the place where you belong, even though you're right up against me. Oh yeah, press my earmuffs and it's just... Oh. I should probably use these headphones for listening to binaural beats. Uh, I just wanted to be risky by standing up and blowing him with the fire extinguisher. Don't want to say anything else, you know. At the risk of being Twitch banned or IP banned. I don't know why I was looking over there. It's like my weapon over there. No, hi, you're right there. How you doing? Do 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 do. What's what music is that? Oh, there's uh, whatever laboratory theme. Karain, I think it is. No, that's the character in Scarlet Sword. I think it's like Crane with a K. I don't know. In other words, it's just the uh, okay. <laughs> it's like a diamond there, but I still see you. The research laboratory from Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. I could aggro you onto me, but I still want to actually... Yeah, what I want to do is not let you see me run, run, run. I'm trying to stand up, and of course you don't actually start running until you're fully up and running, but not running because you are running. <laughs> anyway, let me try this. Make sure you're not coming up this way, which you may very well be. Hi. Hi. Why am I not doing anything productive? <laughs> Close that door. Let's see. Toss another egg timer down yonder. I think that's the same place if I were to do things differently. And I can finish up the thing. I don't think it's necessarily on this floor, but you can never be too careful. They're always up here, so play that little bit of safety. Uh, let's go ahead be safe right here, even though, of course, it may seem like you're out in the open. Okay, as long as Monster may be going, I may not do Pikmin tonight, but I want to try for it. Because uh, I did stay up to like 2.30 last night, even though I was just like relaxing in my bed and struggling to fall asleep and, you know, just looking at memes, of course. Alright, you're going ahead and leaving here, so make use of my time while the day is nigh. Do do do. Go on down, make sure you didn't break the thing down there. But of course, now they have both my egg timers down that way and the fiend aggro to it. He may be chasing after. So I could escape if I so wanted to. No, here's what I'll do. I'll see if I can find a camera up on deck 8, and then I'll work my way down. Well, there's one right there, but I want to get as distance as I can. Come here. Oh, there's not a camera. <laughs> I thought that was something right there, but it's just part of the sailing, Celia. Come on, I'm right here. You want, you want to come get me? I know you want me. I know you care. I did actually fully explore seven, did I? Yeah, the security room and all. Let it ring a couple times. And I say, let it ring. Okay, it's good there. Let freedom ring. <laughs> I kind of laugh when people think that America the Beautiful should be the national anthem. Well, it's kind of stolen from the British. And they're God save the Queen. But who am I to judge people just saying thanks as they enter my mind? Clear to escape on the raft if I want to, but you know, I'm doing that ultimate challenge plus not using duct tape on cameras, so those are the challenges there. 
And plus, it did do the engine room, even though it's not required for any of the three escapes, but you can find a lot of helpful items there, so by proxy, you can at least get things done well enough. And I can go ahead and explore the cargo hold more because I don't really need to carry any more items unless I see another egg timer, which I can just drop that at a good place. Did I not explore this room? Or this little sector? I may very well. Ooh, another backpack! Well, if I only I knew. Maybe the bolt cutters are just in a very basic place. Could be another locked room that I could get into. Have the room for that, even though I still need to go for the keys as well, but I still have. Okay, I only want. But now I do have two fuses saved. This wasn't shown because I was up against some colors. No, not in a racist sense. Ooh, I got a few things to work with. What's in there? Sub battery. Don't need it. No other useful things. It'd just be like a radio or stuff. Don't see things unless the bolt cutters could be glitching, but they ain't. They hate us because they ate us. So maybe I didn't fully explore three. <laughs> see? It's the good thing that I'm, that I'm actually checking. Uh, wait. <laughs> kind of looks like bolt cutters, but it's not. It's just a couple things to cuck you a little bit. For lack of better words. I mean, yeah, there's better words that I could very easily use to screw me over. Disgruntle me. Hey, he must have spawned from here. If things are being as they are because I didn't turn the light off when I left. Or maybe I was just in a hurry to leave. Sorry for the belch. Alright, yeah, here's where I started. And then here's where I checked. Yeah, because I was getting confused because I was thinking that stairs would be over that way. Did check here. Oh, that's the starting room. But I do believe now I am done. So, should I toss an egg timer up that way? Don't think it will. Oh, thought I heard his sounds. Make sure it's not below me either. So I do have all that extra space, so I can go willy-nilly with what I grab. I could have explored a little bit better if I went in from deck two because here's where I entered at the previous point. So here's what I'll do. I will be careful, of course. Have this at the ready. That is there. So I've already been through that little bit, so let me try to manipulate variables a bit more. Do do do, -do. no entryway for me here. I uh, don't really want to go too high up from here because there's not a lot of spaces and no doors. Come on, be bolt cutters in a straightaway. Feels like this could be a place where it is. Very hopeful about it. Not want to see much there, but just gonna comb the desert. Oop, is there an item that I ran over? Much just be the glow stick rolling around at the speed of sound. Even though it's not even going five miles an hour. Well, it could very well be if I get that supersonic speed going on. <laughs> Ultrasonic toothbrush 88 miles an hour. Just mixing different science fiction fandoms for whatever reason. That's a series I do, I do should be watching through Back to the Future. Because I've only seen... I've seen through the second movie one time, but I want to be more familiarized with it. I'm like, yeah, there's Marty McFly and Doc. The Doctor, even though it's Doctor Who, where you say the Doctor. Uh, whatever. Oh yeah, I was saying that uh, it's a safe place anyway, but... I think I explored where the items would be already, so I could try for the places I've already been. Yeah, I, there's a place I didn't drop down into, but... I may be in fiend territory, just gonna listen a little bit. Press things up against me. Uh -huh. It's always kind of disgruntling, malcontent -ive, when there's that one item you just can't find. Let's just see if I can get lucky, because we're up all night for that. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can ever pull an all-nighter. Like, yeah, there's times when I've stayed up to like 2 a.m. working on things, but all the way through the night, I just couldn't do that to myself. Might as well take the lower grade rather than busting my chops to succeed better, if I'm making sense. Is this where I got the pump? Uh, I'm not really seeing glow sticks anywhere, so might as well drop this one down. <laughs> okay, there's some of these couple guys right here, so I wasn't really going through here. Covering more ground. Is that flashing I see? Let me run towards it and check. <laughs> uh, let's see. No boys around. No spicy boys. <gasps> there's a radio. I didn't really see a uh, bolt cutters in his shot. Come on. Gary needs a new pair of shoes. Oh, I thought those were right there. 
No, not parachutes. Parachute. Not parakeet. Purple? Purple aura? Let's see purple aura. I always gotta check behind you as well. In the case of sneaky deaky monsters. And you know, items. Items are always great. I really shouldn't be standing still when I'm doing things as I'm doing. But you know, let's get things done. Checking all the places. Uh, one place to jump up into. Ugh. I keep seeing all these purple hands. <gasps> okay, don't get too hopeful though. Let's uh, get a place to escape that I know is good. I'm gonna prepare the helicopter first. The uh, it's already done. Run, 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 no. W, I'm hitting W. I dropped my thing. Dropped an egg timer back to. Oh, drop, drop you. So, I'm panicking, man. Uh, door. Go through the door. Don't let things go bad. I dropped my thing in a panic, but I didn't drop my bolt cutters. That's all I need. I've got everything that I need right in front of me. Because I was saying that I didn't want to get too hopeful. I'm. Okay, the music just abruptly stopped. Well, because the egg timer went off. So it's kind of a good thing on my part in that panicky rage. You know what? I'll do that too. Because why not? Oh yeah, I still need to... Oh yeah, I'm not ready to prepare the helicopter. So I need to actually go into deck 5, I believe it is, for me to pick up the keys. Okay, it's still ringing down there. Okay. That's good enough. It may just be starting. Let's see if it rings more. Ring 1, maybe? I think I faintly hear it. So it could be two or three. Either way, I think it's still aggroed down that way anyway, because that was after I did the radio. It could have been aggroed to my radio, but then aggroed back to the egg timer. That should be how things are going. And yay, first burp. Or whatever. Oh yeah, I'm kind of at an odds without a fire extinguisher with me. Is that a little bit of protection? Let's go ahead and put you here. Without starting you up because it can't start you up without the keys. Whoa, hello. Sort of glitch. Not really something I can work with unless I can like glitch through the map by doing that. And have that free protection. Even though the fiend would be up against me and taking me out with his uh, telekinesis. Come on, you can go away. Alright, all is well. I just need to attach you. Yeah, just dump all the gas and let it spread across the ship and blow it up with me on it. If I go down, you're going down with me. And if we go down, then we go down together. Singing it horribly, kind of on purpose, because it just came to mind. And if only I actually listened to the song. <laughs> when I listen to so songs, I shouldn't listen to them on the extra speed, because I do that sometimes. But Because I watch vi videos on higher speeds. Why is this being a thing that it's being? This is the place I at least want to be right now. I'm like, yeah, there's some uh, fire extinguishers around, hopefully, for me to pick up. Probably should have grabbed, seeing if I could grab one elsewhere, you know, in the lower decks. <laughs> it's so tiny in my hand, it's like squishing up against my palm. That's something I can show with that. Uh, here are your rumbly tumblies. Like this, I can demonstrate, demonstrate, you know, with my clippers. I not have seen it too well. Are you right here or right there? It's like you're searching me. There you are. Hello, my friend. Oh, yeah, it's kind of my fault. I was kind of closer to this side, but you'd think more that he'd be coming from the other way. Come on, get up. I'm just going to work my way down because I don't need to be here for any reason. I could toss things up at deck five. Is this the thing? Uh, things could be better than they are being. <laughs> To say the least, or even is that unlocked room or locked room that needs to be unlocked? Is it right here? Yes, here it is. Just be careful, watch for the lights, of course. We've lost the lights, the Amnesia Custom Story. I should stream Amnesia Custom Stories. Could be good. I don't think there's ever anything in here, but I'm gonna check regardless. It's usually a glow stick right around here. Or, you know, smashable. Why not? I'll use one. Ooh, how close are you getting? Too close, five me. Uh, thinking more that way, so. How about I go kabam? Uh, it's gonna land in the ocean, I think. <laughs> it could still make a crashy sound. Okay, it's still doing that. So, put you there if you start chasing me. 
Uh, well, it's kind of a challenge, I guess, if I want to work without a fire extinguisher in this last little bit while I'm preparing all these escapes. I mean, yeah, the raft is just a non-volatile. That's the term I'm thinking of. Because the other ones are making all that noise. I mean, like, yeah, you're making the noise when you're moving the crane over. But it's still, objectively, the easiest one. Or subjectively. <laughs> always get confused. Probably objectively, because it's the object of the situation. I need an English teacher in here to explain objectivity versus subjectivity. Then it's like, I knew that. It's like I act like I know everything, even though I don't really know everything. I just seek more information. Here, I will toss a radio right here. Just to see if you get actually called over there. But if you come from there, I can easily switch you over. I see my bolt cutters right there. And the monster's been over that way, and with all the egg timers and radios going on. Okay, it's just the thing going on when I have this. I was like, wait, it's not glitching behind me, is it? <sighs> heart attack for no reason, even though it wasn't heart attack. Just a good spooking. Uh, feeling itchy on my foot. I hope it's not an ant bite, because I've been by a big pile of ants. Come on. Be swift about this, you know. Swift on the shift, and not panic like I did against the brute. Alright, you're right up against this, and, okay, you can not kill this, this stream, steam stream, uh, you are wrapping over that way, we'll wrap in here with Mario, trying up here again because I think you can see me, yeah, so you switched over to Geico on your insert shorts plan, you see even, uh, aggro to me specifically, rather than the actual sounds of the Helicopter, the heli, heli chopper. All right, now it's going. So, I mean, yeah, I'm in your line of sight. So of course you're gonna be doing that. But the helicopter is safe and ready to go. Even if you did break the thing, I can still at least leave on it. That's weird though. It's like I have to detach the thing, but I don't have to detach. I just need to go in the room. Okay, I did use the keys. I was like, wait a second. It's like, of course I can power it up with the keys, but I was open the door anyway to have the extra second of safety because you never know what could happen. And I'm not going to move around with these because if I tried to jump down from there, I wouldn't die if I did jump down from up there, but if I tried to use this, it would still glitch me to death. Because that's how things work. Don't want you to actually be in the room while I'm starting this thing up because that could be bad. Task completed. That's just saying uh, something else just because I'm getting all this thing done. Helicopter is fueled, it's all ready to go. Startup sequence, initiate it. Or relaunch sequence. It's like, I can never figure out what that first word was. Like, sub launch, relaunch, release. Like, I definitely hear an onch sound. Charging vehicle. Charging vehicle. See where you're coming from. Where the light is most vulnerable. Let's see which one is it gonna be. Where is it gonna be? Even a week. Uh, so weak, weak F. Saw your aura going headed that way though, which you can still pull yourself back. The light is broken here, so wait for that. I think you're going this way. Percent. All right. So how are we? We're coming up on, I guess. Okay, we're right at 83 minutes now because I saw it change to one, two, three. <laughs> Make sure things are actually going. Takes you a second to actually break down the door, but, you know, just gotta be careful. So, right here, you're passing right by to go for this one, unless you renege on that and come back this way. 50%. It's like I'm just having a complete repeat of everything, but I am playing better. I've kind of had moments where I felt like I was gonna be giving up, but it's like, nah, man, I gotta win at least once to feel complete. And ultimate challenge against the Fiend at that. Ooh. I mean, if you break the door open, that's fine within itself. Uh, don't want to get too close, so, you know, 75%. You can break it open if you so desire. I'll give you the win on that. Not even breaking into it. Like, yeah, you're trying. Are you succeeding? You must have just stopped. Maybe the fiend gets more glitched than the hunter. There you are. Uh, it's, uh, that thing's close. Come on. Ready for launch. SpongeBob. 
There we go. Everything is ready, but I think I'm gonna go for the helicopter. Because I went for the brute. Or, went for the helicopter when I was against the brute. No, I went for the sub against the brute when I was doing the LP. <laughs> Confused some of my words, but pretty much one, unless something weird happens and he just like teleports in front of me and is like, surprise, motherfucker. But nope, that ain't gonna happen. I think I am going to win. Just have an extra fuse in case things go bad. I always have uh, my fire extinguishers with me in case a fire happens, but I win anyway, just for hypothetical situations. Just to have that weird feeling of completion. But yep, we are all done with this. I'll go ahead and let the scene play, because why not? Did I actually show me winning against the Fiend with the helicopter combination? I don't know. I think I did show all the monster combinations. Or at least, uh, winning against the monster. I think my first win was against the Hunter in episode 4, I believe. Or was it episode 3? No, episode 3 was when I had that good run before the ultimate run, of course, against the brute. Then I died when I was about to escape on the raft. So I'm getting a little bit loud listening to the game. It's probably turned down my game volume. Sorry that I'm just messing with my nose with this Kleenex sitting off to the side pump. I'm not in frame too well. I'm gonna have to shift you over when I switch over to Pikmin. Still feeling well enough to play with that. That little sound effect of the helicopter taking off kind of reminds me of uh, part of the hunter chase music. <sighs> it's finally going quiet. <laughs> it's like you can feel sorry for all the monsters like the fiend. His psychic powers aren't strong enough. The hunter, you just knock it down and leave it on the ship. And the brute, you just knock it against the little uh, cargo hold container things by the helicopter probably give some nice head trauma and maybe boil its own brain look at all these names doing very slowly just appreciate all these people Jamie Cross I always remember that name then Adam Dart it's like all these name and then noun thing Cross Dart Clark maybe a clerk Damina Stamina Daniela Patreon backers <laughs> Well, it'd be more kickstarters. I would definitely kickstart a Monstrum 2. Is there one for Attack of the Earthlings? I should actually look more into the game and see if I actually would be interested in it because it's just the thing that it's not Monstrum 2, I'm not interested. Just like how Splatoon, you know I love that game. Well, maybe not. <laughs> I didn't do the stream of uh, the demo for Splatoon 2, but I do love the first game as well, even though I said I've been wanting to stream it, but I haven't really played it too much. I've been playing at least Pikmin games on my Wii U. But yeah. I think I made my point on that because, uh, Splatoon. Is that a Mario Sunshine dude? No, it's just some weird new IP from Nintendo. I've kind of already explained myself, but here we are. Done with Monstrum. Uh, let's go into my collectibles. I'm still feeling the urge to stream. Of course, I'm going to be switching to Pikmin after a quick little break. Close enough to an hour and a half here. Kind of as long as a run would take. Audio logs, let's listen to, how about number five? Hey mom, hey dad. Still in that work shit, but doing some solo work at the bottom of the ship, I decided to want some so maybe you back into the bike. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is stupid. Right. Deck one valves all seem secure. No leakages or pressure buildups. Hopefully yep. checkoff started on the engine room and I can get the hell out of here. Cool, cool. Hey checkoff, if you find this oh, yeah. and I'm dead, you can keep the recorder. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Oh shit! You know what that voice reminds me of? I mean, like, yeah, Homer Simpson. I think his name actually is Homer if I were to listen to another one of them, because I do have all 12 right there. But he also reminds me of uh, the beer cake. Like, uh, I guess he's a Swedish YouTuber. I think his first name's like Alexander. And he kind of reminds me of Homer Simpson as well, but. It's hard to tell that he's Swedish aside from, I guess, certain ways of pronouncing things, but he still sounds like he's from New York or something. With a sort of Homer Simpson voice, and also Joel, the Vine Sauce guy, though there's Vinny and then Joel, they're both part, part of Vine Sauce, right? <laughs> Confusing myself, but yeah. Joel, he's from Sweden, and he sounds like he's an American. Of course, he does have the accent as well. But anyway, enough talking about random things that aren't video games. Look at all these secret things. You can't even read the notes. Uh, of course, I'm not really on full aspect ratios. I'm not in 1080p or full screen. I'm just on 720 by 480 
minimize so we can see the game chat even though it could just pull it up on a laptop even though I don't have the laptop immediately in the room. Anyway though, uh, there's my fun with Monstrum. It's, <laughs> be, it's pretty close to 11 to 45, it would be pretty cool if I could ride it out until it's actually 11 to 45 IRL. Uh, that would just be me sitting around here four minutes blowing my nose, drinking water. I should definitely take a drink while I'm doing this. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I don't really like spending too much time just uh, letting things settle, but yeah. It's a little dragon hand right there and the mouse and everything. Anyway, I'm going to take me a quick break, probably starting maybe right at midnight at Pikmin. It'd be kind of weird if I started right at midnight. It would be like, I'm starting right at midnight, but I'm probably just going to put in the description that I'm starting on June 2nd. Anyway, no more monster. I'm going to be switching to Pikmin after a little break. So, stay tuned for that. I'm going ahead. Close out a monster. Yes, I'm sure I want to quit. I love this game. I, I may, I'm pretty close to 12 or 4 hours. 400 hours. 389 is what I'm at right now. <laughs> Confusing myself with stuff. Anyway, finally ending this stream in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Goodbye as I click right now.